Like the video and subscribe right now, and I'll show you a picture of this weird doggo. Ready? 3, 2, 1. Extremely disappointed with this chain of hotels. After winning a prize to stay at this hotel and obtaining a voucher for a single night stay, I requested an extension after 10 days of the voucher expiring. The hotel stay was for two people, and as I had a newborn that I was breastfeeding, I was not able to leave my baby with others. The hotel refused to extend my voucher for a measly period of 10 days. Great to see that this hotel group supports breastfeeding mothers and women. Go to hell. When someone asks where is your mask, how about no? Cigarette smoking and breastfeeding? My son is 5 months and I smoked throughout my whole pregnancy and he came out a happy healthy baby. Just because you smoked 6 during pregnancy and baby is okay doesn't mean it's safe. It isn't safe at all, and I never said it was I was just stating a fact with my pregnancy not yours or anyone else's. I smoked my whole pregnancy too girl. My OB knew about it too. I now have a happy healthy 3 month old baby girl. Any other symptoms? Put the kid in a plastic bag in a warm bath. 103 to 104 degree water is the best. Rub honey and cayenne on their gums. You need to get it above 101 at least before you give her anything to eat or drink or it could cause further issues. Watch out for interstitial pneumonia. We just lost a kid with it on Monday. No symptoms except a low temp and by the time we realized what was going on it was too late. Why would she want to raise her infant's temp? Oh my god. I thought this was in my goat emergency group. Normal goat temp is 102. All of this advice is for baby goats. Please do not follow any of it. Dear Starbucks, please make an express lane for your professional customers. There's no reason I should have to wait 45 minutes while one barista cranks out 15 triple caramel half cap frap low fat whip whatever the duck monstrosities when all I ordered was a cold brew, black. The next person who tells me I shouldn't be putting cereal in my daughter's bottles is getting screamed at. Like just a blood cold scream. Duck off Karen. You shouldn't be putting cereal in your daughter's bottles. Find nothing wrong just never rate anyone 5 stars ever the highest I ever give is a 4 star rating. Food workers getting all but that when a customer comes in just minutes before closing. It's your fault for cleaning up before closing time. You should clean after closing time. You get more hours that way anyway. Now make my ducking food, cause your last still open. Shouldn't have cleaned up, ducking idiots. Went to dentist today and they tried to force us to wear a mask and the manager said she was going to charge $2 per mask and that we had to wear it while drinking. Mind you that everyone in the restaurant didn't have a mask on and that's called discrimination. Look it up. After being attacked for my beliefs the manager told me to get the hell out all because I didn't put a mask on to walk two feet to take it off. Not buying the BS. America is losing its freedom because of forced compliance over 99.98% survivable virus wake up America. This is what our soldiers fought for and you're la letting them take it away without a fight. Not me and I'm unapologetic for it. Feeling cold. Lost power at 7.35 pm. Reported it to they were not aware. I think someone slash a tree must have taken out a pole or one of our underground power bunkers. My view is solid black. Normally I see lights. Just when the bliss of complete quiet, I hear the start of my neighbor's generator, which will run non-stop day and night till power is restored. Should schools have a mental health class? A class where you learn about depression, anxiety, suicide distress, eating disorders, social pressure, ADHD, dyslexia, self-harm, bipolar disorder psychosis, ways to cope, and where to find support and help. No. They should have a bible study class. Mental illness is a cover for demonic possession. Jesus can set you free. So I have a question. My daughter is 11. Her room is right under us. Our bed and floor is loud when we um, you know. We try to be as quiet as we can but it's impossible. 
Well tonight she comes up walks in and yells I can hear you. I think this is so rude and disrespectful. I'm not sure how to address it with her and that it's just a part of life. She is going to hear us from time to time, but I her walking in and saying that is not okay. Kelly, Karen. Spotted two kids selling lemonade at a stand without a license. Looked anywhere between 7 to 10. I confronted these kids and they told me they did not have a license. Both had brown hair. Parents, check with your kids to make sure we are not compromising our local safety. Thanks. Just heard an American woman angrily tell an airport employee, if you don't speak English, then why are you working here? Ma'am, you're in Shanghai, China. Okay you all are so amazing. Can I request help? My ex-husband has alienated me from our kids and I want to find him and get full custody. Recipe notes. To freeze half for up to 4 months. Transfer half the pesto to a small airtight container and smooth the surface. Drizzle with olive oil to cover. Label, date, and freeze. To thaw, place in the fridge for 3 to 4 hours or until thawed. Stir to combine. Reviews. Carry. I substituted half a cup of parsley and found it lacked a little flavor. That's because you substituted half a cup of parsley. Karen. Featured comment. Helena B. Online school. Listen carefully. Me. Looks up hente. If you want to be featured in the next video use hashtag dankness. I ate here for the first time tonight. The brisket was probably the best I've ever had, but I found an entire leaf in my baked beans. I cannot make this up. So, we are glad you enjoyed the brisket. I'm guessing you've never seen bay leaves in your food before. If you see them in the future you can rest assured that that is a sign that someone spent time and effort making your food from scratch. We pride ourselves on making everything fresh in house, no cans ever. So you will find unique spice blends and herbs being used in our food. That includes bay leaves. Again I'm glad you enjoyed the brisket and I'm sorry the leaf surprised you. I'm just going to leave this here. You can vaccinate your kids and then hold a raw potato to the wound where the needle entered and it will suck the toxins from the vaccines out, leaving only the non-toxic parts. It's a great way to stay healthy and thwart big pharma. You know what, I will accept potato placebo if it means anti-vaxxers start vaccinating their kids. Hey everyone, long story short, I want a dog, my grandma not. I live with my boyfriend in her house, but we have our own space, it's a big house, so we renovate a few rooms at our own, we pay rent and I would build kennel outside, so the dog can go outside. I would take all of the work and pay for this dog of my own. The only thing my grandma must slash could do is to look after the dog when I'm at work, 35 to 40 hours a week so 8 to 9 per day, but my grandma is still against it. She always had dogs and animals, and I have the feeling she just have to befriend with this dog and she would like him. So what should I do? Karen. Google, Twitter and Facebook think they can control the voice of the people. Wrong. We will speak up. We will speak out. We will find our voice. But isn't it Facebook that is allowing you to make this statement? Went in this morning. Wore my mask into the store. Only customer in the store. Took my mask off. To be able to breathe a little better. Was asked to wear my mask at all times in the store. Even though I was nowhere near anyone else. I had it available to put on if necessary. Needless to say I didn't buy anything from their store. Angry hedge fund billionaire Leon Cooperman is mad at GameStop Redditors for attacking wealthy people. Gonna cry? A pal's brother was with his girlfriend for 7 years. 16 months ago she said she wasn't happy and ducked him off for another lad. He's just got a £210,000 inheritance and she's just been to a solicitor to see if she's entitled to any of it. Some ducking people. Cheeky bastard. Would love some suggestions on any natural doctors, anyone know? Like ones that don't believe in vaccinations etc. And teaching natural healing. Thanks in advance. This place is awful. 
came for the hyped experience, staff was rude, drinks were watered down, crowded college bar during Ovid, never again. Beware. I'm glad you followed through with the threat you made about leaving a bad review on your way out the door now so allow me to retort. You and your friend were both belligerent with our staff and unwilling to comply with our simple masking rules for Rovid safety. Worse still you only complained about your drink because the new Asian guy made it, yikes, and not Sunny. For the record, K is a dope bartender and Sunny thinks you're a jerk off too. Accusing us of being a crowded college bar is pretty rich coming from an over the hill frat boy who resorts to threats about a bad review when he gets cut off before 10, but hey that's showbiz baby. The city of Winnipeg would like to remind residents to please stop creating shrekshally suggestive snow people, especially around schools. City crews have dismantled dozens around the city. This photo was sent to us by Karen at Kildonan Park. We have blurred the phallic object in question. Has anyone encapsulated their own placenta? Could I use an air fryer instead of a dehydrator? Any info or resources helps. You've been visited by Super Doggo. This doggo will protect you from all your enemies, but only if you comment. You're a hero, Super Doggo. Thanks for watching. Do not forget to subscribe for more daily videos.